again. So this past weekend, I got to the opportunity to stop at Sheep Thrills in Lauder Hill, Florida. There we go. It's Patty Jacobson is the owner. And that's their address, North University Drive. It's a really nice little area. We stopped Sunday, like, around 3, 4. So I'm sure it was, you know, deader in the area than what it usually is. Just because... People were in church or lunch or whatever. Finally home. So, let's see what I bought. This is their little bag of goodies. So, as you all know, um, well, you probably don't actually. I only buy from other indie dyers. Um, it's just one of those stances that I've taken. Since I'm a dyer myself, I feel like we need to support each other. And so, that's the way I go. Um, I also don't knit very often or crochet or weave. I'm super slow at it. So, that is also why... I can handle doing that. It's not like I'm a production knitter and I need to keep up with enough stuff. I'm super slow, so it's not like I'm going to go through what I've already bought. I have a lot of yarn. So the first one, which I've been following this dyer. I don't even know if I follow them online, but I've seen it at a couple different shops. Um, and then I saw Sheep Thrills had post about, about their entomology collection Friday or Saturday. And I was like, okay, yep, we got to stop because I want to check them out. So... This is Round Mountain Fibers. There we go. And this is part of her ornithology collection. And this is Wood Duck. Which, I'm sorry, but if you've ever seen a Wood Duck in the wild, this is pretty spot on. They are beautiful. They sort of are similar to uh, like a Mandarin duck in colors. Um, but they're beautiful. They're, they are here in Florida. I see them all the time around the lake. So I had to get one. And this is 100% Superwash Merino. And it's fingering weight. Let's see, there we go. 100 grams, 400 yards. So, it's a nice squishy yarn. Very sturdy feeling. Very round. This is from Twisted Owl Fiber Studio in Longview, Texas. Ah, there we go. Let's see if I can get this to work. So, this is a sport. Sport weight three ply. I didn't even realize that when I picked it up in Tukey Tukey, I'm assuming. 328 yards. And look how beautiful it is. I don't know why I'm feeling like toucan, so I'm assuming that's what Tukey Tukey, maybe. But I feel it's a very tropical feeling yarn. And it's also 100% superwash merino. Very pretty. Dylan was with me in the store and he really liked it. Also. Ah! They're trying to sneak out. This is from, ah, there we go. It's actually, it's Black Cat Fibers. You can sort of see it. I believe it's Carol. Um, there we go. Black Cat Fibers, LLC.etsy.com. And um, Carol, I'm pretty sure it's Carol. Um, up in Canada. And so this is Indecision. And it's a fingering 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon, nomad sock, and it's 463 yards, 100 grams. It's really nice. I was super into the dark. It's like a dark rainbow. Even Dylan, he was like, Mom, it's a rainbow. It seems like something you would buy. So I had to buy it. Um, dun -dun -dun. This is from Crazy Dog Yarns. And clearly, we have a rainbow, so we had to get it. And then it's like a, it's more of a golden yellow. There we go. That's actually about what color it is. But it is a self-striping sock, peace, love, and lobster. Oh, how fun is that? And, oh, it's 100% superwash merino. And I'm not sure if this is like a 50 gram skein or if it's a 100 gram skein. The label was kind of confusing to me. Um, because it says that it's a 100 gram skein, but it doesn't really feel like it is. So I'm not sure, but I will surely weigh it and find out. And she is crazydogyarns.etsy.com. And I'll post links to all of these people, um, as well as Sheep Thrills underneath. So if you want to check them out, you are more than welcome to. And lastly, it's just a little seedling. This is from the Fiber Seed. Um, and Lindsay is in actually in Tampa. So she is a local dyer, and this is a 90% superwash merino and 10% nylon in her acorn colorway. And I looked at the big one, 
And there's something about the way it looks when it's like been rescained that I was like, nope, I just want this one just because, and I'll probably end up buying one that is a full skein just because it's really pretty together. Um, greens and browns and a beige color. Um, yeah, but it doesn't really tell me anything else other than what I've already let you know. So, but she is the fiber seed. So we have crazy dog yarns, the fiber seed, black cat fibers, twisted owl, and round mountain fibers Oop. and they were all purchased at sheep thrills in lauderhill florida thank you